A tragic death at the World Cup. Beloved American journalist Grant Wall collapsing during the Netherlands-Argentina match on Friday. Will Reeve, of course, has been covering these games and has the latest. Will granted so much for U.S. soccer, so much for young sports journalists coming up. He really did, Cecilia. Good morning. He elevated the profile of the game that he loved. And Grant Wall was known as the consummate journalist, dogged in his pursuit of telling truth to power, beloved by friends and colleagues and those who consumed his work. It was at work, the World Cup in Qatar, where Wall died suddenly, stunningly, inspiring tributes and as yet unanswered questions like why and how. Through his work, Grant shared his love of football with millions. This morning, a shocking tragedy at the World Cup. Renowned journalist Grant Wall suddenly dying while covering a game Friday. In the waning minutes of the drama-filled quarterfinal match between Argentina and the Netherlands, Wall reportedly collapsing in his seat. Paramedics reportedly trying to revive him on site before he was rushed to a hospital where he was pronounced dead. The cause of Wall's death still unclear. The 48-year-old, in many ways the voice of soccer in the United States... Uh, maybe convincing Americans who didn't embrace soccer to embrace it was a bit of a harder sell. ...was covering his eighth World Cup. His packed schedule of covering matches and recording his podcast, Football with Grant Wall, wearing on him to the point that he visited a local health clinic. My body, I think, told me, even after the U.S. went out, dude, you are not sleeping enough. <laughs> and it rebelled on me. Just one day before his death, Wall mentioning his battle with bronchitis. I'm coughing a lot that sounds like a death rattle sometimes. His agent and friend, Tim Scanlon, had been worried about him. I said we could back off the schedule. And he said, no, I, I can handle the work. I, I like doing the work. And just three weeks ago, Wall wearing this rainbow T-shirt to a World Cup game in Qatar, where same-sex relations are illegal, saying security initially refused to let him into the stadium. The U.S. State Department says it is involved in getting Wall home and determining the circumstances of his tragic death. And overnight, reports of another journalist dead in Qatar. The Gulf Times reporting Qatari photojournalist Khalid al-Mislam died suddenly on Sunday. Those circumstances are unclear. Mm. All right, well, thank you so much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.